the Miami Dolphins' injury issues were most publicized and noticed on the offensive side of the ball in 2020. Such is a natural byproduct of a rookie quarterback struggling to find open receivers down the stretch of a playoff run. But the Dolphins did have several notable defensive players go down with injury this season as well, including defensive tackle Davon Godshow. Godshow, who was in a contract year in 2020, was hoping to play well enough to secure a long-term contract and some added financial security. But a biceps injury bounced Godshow from the field early and the Dolphins' defense was forced to pivot down the stretch. And pivot, they did. The Dolphins found rookie defensive tackle Raekwon Davis securing the nose tackle position in the second half of the season and shining in such a role. And opposite Christian Wilkins in some of the Dolphins' odd fronts was Zach Sealer, who played so well this season that he himself got a two-year, $7.6 million extension in November. Do those emergences spell the end for Godshow in Miami? Not necessarily, as Godshow is reportedly still expecting Miami to come calling. A source close to Godshow said he expects the Dolphins to approach him about a new contract, but that the sense is that he might get more money elsewhere. Miami would be wise to not break the bank or even offer starting money. Because for all of Godshow's merits as a terrific presence in the community, he's ultimately undersized to play the nose versus Davis, he's listed 19 pounds lighter and not penetration-oriented to the same degree as Sealer. Sealer's 2020 campaign featured more sacks 3.5 than Godshow has logged in his entire career through 52 games 3.0. Sealer had 11 tackles for loss this season, Godshow has 12 in 52 games. Godshow is a sturdy plug player for a gap control defense but he's ultimately not going to create or make plays. And with Davis now, now set to man the middle, the Dolphins don't likely have a place amid their cap situation to pay Godshow handsomely to be a low-impact role player. We'll know soon whether or not Miami deems Godshow as a long-term piece. But even if they do, it is likely going to be at a lighter rate. And Godshow is the only person who can make the decision on if that is the right move for him.